Hello, I'm Justine Murphy with Laser Focus World. Let's take a look at some of the amazing things happening in photonics. Whether on land, deep in the sea, or in the air, seamless connectivity and real-time data exchange could soon be possible with an all-light communication network. Developed by researchers at Nanjing University of Posts and Telecommunications in China, the mobile complete mapping optical system facilitates two-way data transmission in real time within and across communication networks, regardless of their environment. The new network is integrated with full duplex light communication with light sources of varied wavelengths based on the Transmission Control Protocol Internet Protocol, as well as image recognition and tracking technologies, optical fiber, and Wi-Fi. It also combines mobile and fixed nodes that are fully symmetric and decentralized. It can function as a closed loop light communication system too, with automatic fail safe tools to ensure uninterrupted performance in any conditions. And in a series of tests in various environments, the network proved resistant to electromagnetic interference. The researchers are now working to strengthen the network security by incorporating coding and encryption algorithms. Ultimately, they say these advancements could someday benefit navigation and emergency response in even the most challenging settings. There are a lot of exciting things happening in the business realm, including a new strategic partnership meant to advance manufacturing of LiDAR and 3D sensing technologies. The collaboration involves programmable optical semiconductor developer Lumotive and ePhotonics, a manufacturing facility for 3D solid-state LiDAR technology based in Saudi Arabia. Company representatives say ePhotonics will use Lumotive's light control metasurface technology to develop and manufacture next-generation 3D sensing for robotics, drones, and smart infrastructure. The company also plans to design LiDAR products using Lumotive's solid-state beam steering technology. Elsewhere, France-based research institute Cialetti has unveiled the FAMES pilot line, an initiative meant to promote semiconductor technology and greener electronics. This comprehensive set of technologies can facilitate development of chip architectures, including embedded non-volatile memories for enhancing storage capabilities in advanced integrated circuits, radio frequency components that will optimize high-performance connectivity for next-generation wireless applications, and 3D integration technologies for enhanced chip functionality. Citing extreme nonlinear light emission properties, an international team of researchers is now exploring luminescent nanocrystals for faster, more energy efficient data processing and AI. Scientists from Lawrence Berkeley National Lab, Columbia University, and the Autonomous University of Madrid have discovered this robust and scalable nanomaterial can act as a binary optical switch or a mini measurement unit. Essentially, the bistable luminescent nanocrystals can switch from bright to dark states and emit light at an intensity that can increase significantly with a tiny laser boost. The nanocrystals are made from inorganic materials, specifically potassium, chlorine, and lead, and infused with lanthanide ions, the active ions in luminescent materials that are most often used in optoelectronics applications. While these nanocrystals can't interact with light, they do enable lanthanide ions to do it, and more efficiently than with conventional approaches. Fundamental optical bistability is a result of such interaction. The team says luminescent nanocrystals could be controlled to store information, making them ideal for optical computing and memory. And that's your Photonics Hot List. Be sure to like and share, subscribe to our YouTube channel, follow us on social media, and visit laserfocusworld.com for the latest and coolest news and information. Check out our Following the Photons podcast, too, for some cool interviews and news impacting the industry. Until next time.